Hello and welcome to This Date in History, aka TDH. This show is all about the events that occurred today in years past, both recognized by actual historians, but mainly things I personally find intriguing enough for me to bring to you. The source of this information comes from the smart device application on this day. The music in the background is Home by Konak, which I found on the YouTube channel No Copyright Sounds, aka NCS. For links to the app, music, and anything else potentially interesting, check the underbar. YouTube viewer, I choose you! Now let's get on with the show, shall we? Today is Tuesday's Day, aka Tuesday, August 9th, 2016. In 2014, Michael Brown, an 18-year-old black male in Ferguson, Missouri, was shot and murdered by a Ferguson law enforcer, sparking protests and unrest in the city. In 2006, at least 21 suspected terrorists were arrested in a 2006 transatlantic aircraft plot that happened in the United Kingdom. These arrests were made in London, Birmingham, and High Wycombe during an overnight operation. Now what's weird is that the source said at least 21 arrests, but never gave me a solid number. I wonder why that is. Is someone hiding something? In 1999, Russian President Boris Yeltsin fired his Prime Minister, Sergei Stefanson, and for the fourth time, fired his entire cabinet. In 1993, the Liberal Democratic Party of Japan lost a 38-year hold on national leadership. In 1974, as a result of the Watergate scandal, Richard Nixon became the first President of the United States of America to resign from office. His Vice President, Gerald Ford, then took his place. In 1971, during the Troubles, the British Army in Northern Ireland launched Operation Demetrius, in which hundreds of people were arrested and interned. In addition to that, thousands were displaced and 20 people were murdered during the violence that followed. In 1969, followers of Charles Manson murdered pregnant actress Sharon Tate, who was the wife of Roman Polanski. They also murdered coffee heiress Abigail Folger, Polish actor Wojciech Fryowski, men's hairstylist Jay Sebring, and recent high school graduate Stephen Parent. In 1965, a fire at a Titan missile base near Searcy, Arkansas, caused the deaths of 53 construction workers. Also in 1965, Singapore was expelled from Malaysia and became the only country to date to gain independence unwillingly. In 1956, 20,000 women staged a march on the Union buildings in Pretoria to protest against the proposed amendments to the urban areas in South Africa. In 1945, the Red Army invaded Japanese-occupied Manchuria. Also in 1945, during World War II, Nagasaki was devastated when the atomic bomb Fat Man was dropped by a United States B-29 Boxstar. 35,000 people were murdered outright, which included 23,200 to 28,200 Japanese war workers, 2,000 forced Korean workers, and 15 Japanese soldiers. In 1944, during the Continuation War, the Vyborg Petrozavodsk Offensive, which was the largest offensive launched by the Soviet Union against Finland during the Second World War, ended with a strategic stalemate. Both Finnish and Soviet troops at the Finnish front dug into defensive positions and the front remained stable until the end of the war. Also during 1944, the United States Forest Service and the Wartime Advertising Council released posters featuring Smokey Bear for the first time. I say boo boo, this is the incorrect reference! In 1942, during World War II, during the Battle of Savo Island, Allied naval forces protecting their amphibious forces during the initial stages of the Battle of Guadalcanal were surprised by an Imperial Japanese Navy cruiser force. Also in 1942, Indian leader Mahatma Gandhi was arrested in Bombay by British forces, thus launching the Quit India movement. In 1930, Betty Boop made her cartoon debut in Dizzy Dishes. In 1914, the Battle of Mulhouse started. This was the first French offensive during World War I and was an attempt to recover the province of al Saki. In 1907, the first Boy Scout encampment concluded at Brown Sea Island in southern England. In 1892, Thomas Edison received a patent for a two-way telegraph. In 1842, the Webster-Ashburton Treaty was signed, establishing the Canadian-U.S. border east of the Rocky Mountains. In 1814, during the Native American Wars, the Creeks signed the Treaty of Fort Jackson, giving up huge parts of Alabama and Georgia. In 1329, Quillen, the first Indian Christian diocese, was erected by Pope John XXII. After that, the French-born Jordanus was appointed the first bishop. And in 1173, construction of the Campanile of the Cathedral of Pisa, known today as the Leading Tower of Pisa, began. It took two centuries or 200 years to complete. 
Deaths, Bernie Mac 2008. And that concludes the show. Once again, check the underbar for any links you may be interested in. Don't forget to look right and left at every intersection, especially if you're playing Pokemon Go. Also, rate five thumbs and subscribe if you're so willing to do so. For your dose of past events daily, I am Aosander, and you are you. Toodles!